the front of Demi's Diner, a sea of bricks after a partial collapse of the downtown Nakoma Eatery. It's just gone. The whole building is gone. 12.15 in the morning, the Nakoma's Fire Department received a call of a partial building collapse. It was the diner downstairs and two people trapped upstairs in an apartment. On arrival, the family that lived upstairs, the business, was still in the structure. We were able to use ladders and remove them from the back of the structure. For one resident of that apartment, a very close call. Uh, one of them was just on the other side of the chair. Oh my gosh. He'd fell asleep watching TV. He woke up real fast. Yeah. A small section of Route 16 temporarily closed. The neighboring Nokomis Medical Group closed for the day. Ken Wilbur owns a business just a couple of buildings away. He knew nothing about it until he came to work. I thought at first it was a fire, but it's not. It just collapsed. Ken came to town and went to his normal parking spot. This morning I, I come out in my alley back behind is blocked off. I couldn't get to the back of my shop, so I pulled up in the front here and saw this. I was really surprised. The cause of the collapse is under investigation by the state fire marshal. There was no fire or explosion, and the building probably dates back to the early 1900s. It seems to be more of a natural failure of the structures. There were no injuries in the collapse. In Nokomis, Doug Wolf, WAND News.